Dear ladies and gentlemen, it is a great honor for Kazakhstan to host such a high-profile global conference in Astana. We extend our appreciation to the World Health Organization and the United Nations Children's Fund for their trust extended to us to hold the global conference in Kazakhstan. Today, we host around 1,500 participants as guests, representing more than 114 WHO member states, international organizations, and higher reaches of academic life from all regions of the world, America, Europe, Africa, Southeast Asia, Eastern Mediterranean, and Western Pacific. Welcome to Kazakhstan. We are proud that 40 years ago, the Almata Declaration, which the UN named as the Great Charter of Worldwide Healthcare, was adopted in our land. The document is special because all status for the first time in history have officially recognized the right of people to health. This is the main value that the Republic of Kazakhstan aspires and that was mentioned today by our President Nur Sultan Nazarbayev. Since gaining independence in 1991, we have made a breakthrough in universal coverage of our citizens with healthcare services. Primary healthcare is one of the priorities of our national healthcare system. In 27 years of independence, we have established a far-reaching PHC infrastructure that includes 1,808 clinics, centers, and outpatient hospitals, the financing share of whole volume of free medical aid guaranteed by the constitution of our country has increased firefold and reached 40%. During the last 10 years, we have been focusing our efforts on disease prevention. The screening annually covers 2 million adults of the country. Moreover, we vaccinate against 21 infectious diseases. The program covers 5 million people annually. Health of people and availability of health care are fundamental priorities of our state and President Nur Sultan Nazarbayev. This is seen in the 2050 long-term development strategy of our country and is an important course within the third modernization wave of Kazakhstan. The main goal is to form a modern healthcare system in accordance with the OECD standards. To achieve this goal every year, we adjust our objectives. In his recent address to the nation of Kazakhstan for 2019, President Nazarbayev has set forth the task to increase spending to healthcare and education up to 10% of GDP. In the nearest three years only, healthcare spending will be increased by 24%. Special attention will be attached to the availability of primary healthcare, particularly in rural areas. From 2019, all polyclinics and hospitals of the country will switch over to paperless digital documentation. From January 2020, each citizen of our country will have electronic health passport. In 2019, we will start the construction of the National Scientific Oncological Center in Astana. A healthy nation is not just about medicine, but it is also about living healthy lifestyles. Therefore, the government is implementing a specialized program on promoting among the population healthy and active in lifestyle and discarding unhealthy habits. In the nearest future, we will additionally construct 100 fitness and health facilities across the country that will increase the availability for population. Such closer attention to the quality of health care is related and emerging challenges. We all see it. The world is changing, and technological progress requires update of our views and responses to new challenges. First of all, it is about comprehension of the new role of primary health care in disease management, transfer of new digital technologies, and uh, innovations to health care system, training human resources. We have progressed in this direction. As a result of joint efforts of the WHO, member states, and academia, a new declaration on primary health care is drafted. 
adoption of their declaration within this global conference in Astana will set new directions for development of PHC as a basis of healthcare system of any country. The new declaration reflects obligations of countries, people, communities, healthcare systems and partners to achieve healthy life through sustainable PHC. The government of Kazakhstan expresses its appreciation to the WHO and UNICEF, states and international non-governmental organizations, to everyone who have contributed to the development of the document. We believe that the declaration must be promoted with a global agenda to be considered at the World Health Assembly in Geneva and put forward at the UN General Assembly at the level of heads of state of in September 2019. The new declaration is a will of nations united to promote the strategy of strong PhD in the 21st century. The participants of the conference, I am confident that the global conference in Astana will allow us to find answers to a broad range of questions. Kazakhstan is open to dialogue and stands ready for cooperation. I wish you successful work and thank you for your attention.